i think i am short-sighted but i've always had the fear of wearing glasses but today i am going to face my fear Hey loves and welcome to my channel if this is the first time you are seeing my gorgeous face my name is Cheta and I create yummy juicy fun loving amazing content in Abuja Nigeria you are definitely welcome on board if you are a returning subscriber ah thank you so much for the growth for the love I love you guys and appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart if you are yet to subscribe what are you waiting for Please click the subscribe button down below and do not forget to like this video if you enjoyed it because i mean and turn on your notification bell so that you get notified whenever i post new banking content because i am going to be posting back-to-back -back content so yeah guys without rambling let's get into what today's video is about so guys today uh, i am going to um face my fear i've been having this situation where since you knew shout out to my uni girls when we're in class, I can barely see from the back. It's like I'm straining my eyesight to see. Do you get? Um, I can't see from the back. I practically have to copy from my friends when we're taking notes. So, guys, I've had this thing. I feel I, I think I am short-sighted, but I've always had the fear of wearing glasses. But today, guys, I've decided to defeat my fear and carry you guys along with me. So I'm going to check out my eyesight. I have an appointment with an eye doctor by two. I'm like a few minutes late, but yeah i'm heading out now i just pray that i do not need glasses but i think um a lot of people have told me see you strain your eyes like you practically squint when you're trying to see things just go check your eyes out you might just correct it for a period of time and get back to you. like you don't necessarily have to use glasses for the rest of your life but i've kept pushing back because of fear but today guys i'm defeating that fear and i'm taking you guys along so i'm going to What's the name of the hospital? I'll show you guys when I get there. But I'm about leaving the house. So guys, come along with me. Let us face this fear. <laughs> so um, I forgot to mention that I booked this appointment using my HMO. And um, my appointment is, I think, with Optical Dentals at Sedi Plaza. So that's where I'm going to now. So yeah, guys, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm already late. Like, I need to get lateness away from my life. But well, let's go, guys. I just got into Sedi Plaza. So let me look for the optical visions and go there. I'm just trying to park the car and once I do that, uh, we're heading. I'm already late, see guys, I, I am 51 minutes late. My appointment was for two, this is 2.51. Let's go, Sha. Guys, I hate basements like this. They remind me of horror movies. <laughs> So guys, I got to Optical Visions and like I told you guys, I already had an appointment. So I waited a bit to see the doctor and while I was waiting, I was savoring and enjoying the environment. Then I was given this survey form to fill um, so that they can get more information as to why I was here before I was then led to the doctor's office. You mentioned of having a blood Yes. No, when it's far. So if I'm reading something far, 
and it's small. Like I can see that I clean it now, but if it's smaller, I might not. I might just be saying something below. I don't know what I'm saying. So if I'm driving at night and car headlights kind of affect. Any pain, headache, itching the eyes? No, nothing. Are you using glasses? Never. This is your first eye examination? Yes. So I've not really seen the need to visit a doctor because it's not stopping me from doing my day to day activities. This thing has been for years, like since I was maybe since 20. I noticed it first in 20, maybe 16 or 15, 2015, 2016. But like I said, it, it was in school. So if a teacher is at the front and is writing on the board, I won't be able to see what person is writing until I go closer. Yeah. Yes. So guys, after the questions and all the consultation gist, we hopped into the full eye examination. So he started out with examining my light, my eyes with light. He did one without light. He examined with colors, with letters, with different yes. lenses, with different equipments, all all kinds of things basically until we had a final verdict. guys so guys today is tuesday i have not given you guys updates about my entire hospital visit but today is tuesday almost two days after the last clip you guys saw i've been so busy trying to give you guys an update and i've been procrastinating but today i am headed to work and i'm dressing up guys so you guys will bear with me i'll be dressing up while i'm giving you the gist so um as you guys already saw when i got there the first thing we did was an examination so they examined my eyes he was examining it with colors with letters he even did some examination of the eye itself with the environment dark so he did one with the light on then started testing my eyesight quality with letters and colors and a few basic things sha 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 yeah so that was what he did guys and then he kept at a point he started using lenses like different lenses to check um what will work for me what will help me see better he'll be like oh this lens did it help you see better he will now increase it or decrease it whatever the case may be sha that was what we did for like most of the time while i was there um that was what he did for the most part of me being there i don't know if this my hair is properly done but guys i have to manage it so yeah guys like i was saying that was what he did for the most part of me being there after all the examinations guys he then told me that um i would need glasses and he told me the kind of glass i would need based on the examination and all the test trial oh this will be better for your eyesight and all of that i'm applying my sunscreen sha um in case you're wondering what i'm doing so yeah he told me this would be better for my eyesight and this is what i would need uh, he told me that the, the glass he's recommending helps with um i think light emission it helps with um the the eyesight that's the lens he's recommending it helps with i think light emission with the sunlight to protect me from the sunlight to protect me from direct light and the computer screen and a few other things shahi Shah gave me a rundown of what um what it is that he was the lens he was recommending for me was going to do for me <laughs> next thing that happened was that he told me uh, my usage of the glasses unfortunately he said it's an all-time wear which was really scary for someone that has never worn glasses since she was born so it was really scary for me i will not lie he told me it was an all-time wear i needed to use it all time except when i'm taking my bath or when i am sleeping even for exercise i had to ask even for exercise say yes you use it for exercise because you need to stop straining your eyes and all of that so it was really confusing to me because i'm like ah, is it that my eyes is at a critical stage right now you get i asked all those questions but he just said you need it to correct your sight and all of that 
so the next thing i did was i asked him about correction like what's the plan for correction is this going to be a a thing that is going to help me correct this situation but he told me that i am not nine years old neither am i 17 years old so he cannot guarantee the correction of my eyes that like if it was that age range he'll be able to guarantee and say oh by this time your eye will be better but he can't guarantee that for me because i am older but that he, even if there will be a correction period guys you need to listen it has to be between three to 11 years that's literally a long time in my life now guys so it was really really scary to me and then before he told me this information i was like please take a seat because i was thinking it's something that they'll tell me oh one year two years six months you are correct he said please take a seat so the thing you know how like when the doctor is giving someone the sad news that's how it felt sha but yeah guys that was it basically um he said that i would i would have to use it for all time and it's not a correction like my eyes have already developed so it's not like i'm a child that i'm developing again so the next thing he recommended the lens like i said and then a frame i had to pick a frame so they had like a catalog of different frames and honestly if i'm going to make it all time where it has to be something cute so i picked a frame i'll show you guys when the glasses is ready the frame i picked as well as the lens but yeah uh like i told you guys i was working with that with a hmo for those who do not know what HMOs are, they are like health insurance bodies um, in Nigeria. So I was working with the HMO, so they said that um, everything, the lens and the glasses, that the lens is like 50k with all the lights blocking and computer screen blocking and sunlight blocking and all of all those English he just spoke. He said it's 50k and then the lens I picked was 25k. So he said that um, they will check in with the HMO to know how much I am covered and get back to me. So yesterday being Monday, the HMO, um, I think they called the HMO and the HMO said that they are covering me a particular percentage I genuinely cannot remember. Um, but anyways, out of the 75,000 Naira, they are paying 15,000 Naira. So I have to cover the remaining 60,000 Naira. In their defense, I did the basic plan of Reliance HMO. I think it's 30K per year. So I can understand. So mainly she told me that she said, do I want to go ahead and follow up like do I want to finish up the payments? So I said, sure, of course, why not? So she sent me the account details I paid in the morning. And she told me that my glasses will be ready within four days. I think she said by Thursday at the most, I will get my glasses so that I can start wearing it. So yeah, guys, that's the update for you guys. I don't know if I packed this hair well. Let me look at the larger, bigger mirror and see how everything goes together. But yeah, guys, that's the update. Like I said, I'm rushing to work. So let's head out and see you guys um when i'm going for collection hey guys so i am sure you guys are like what is going on the hair color has changed what is happening i have a video coming up on the entire reason why i dyed my hair the hair process is coming up shortly so you guys should look out for that also um today last i left off telling you guys that she said on thursday it should be ready so yesterday she called me and told me to come pick it up but honestly i had like other engagements i had to because yesterday was eid um and a friend of mine invited me for over for lunch you guys will see that video is coming up in fact no it should be out by now that video is already published i'll add a link up here so yeah you guys should go watch it it's so much fun like i had the best day ever uh shout out to my girlie again for doing this but anyways guys now i'm heading down there to go pick up the glasses and i am keeping my fingers crossed that i would love it and yeah let's see how it goes Thank you. Your destination is on the right. Bless me. Okay, so guys, I just got here now, parking and heading in now. And yeah, guys, I'll keep you guys updated on the juicy 
there's nothing juicy sharp but i'll give you guys i'll keep you guys updated on what i get up to all right let's go guys hey guys so guys i just collected my glasses this is it and guys it's time for the big reveal <laughs> god oh my gosh <laughs> i don't even know how to feel all right guys in three two one i'm about to change <laughs> why am i being extra no 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 it's just glasses calm down this is what it looks like can you guys see this is it yeah and let's test it out <laughs> i'm just being extra whoa guys like literally everything lifted like it feels like everything is closer now everything is clearer guys so this is my new reality jesus like everything geez like everything is literally closer to me i can see everything more clearly wow god guys this is a lot but anyways um yeah i would end this video here do you know why guys you guys should stick around because i'm going to be using carrying you guys along the journey of me getting adjusted to my glasses for the next 24 to 48 hours so basically you know the basic things i do so you guys should stick around for that in the next video i hope it goes well so i'm going to use it for my basic things to read to do my exercise to go about my day if i can cook sure to eat every single thing and i'll tell you guys how i feel after like 24 to 48 hours so you guys should come along on that journey if you are yet to subscribe what are you waiting for please click the subscribe button down below and do not forget to like this video because you will definitely definitely enjoy it it helps me out a whole lot when you like the video and share it as well okay also your notification box put it on so that you get informed when i post the next video all right guys thank you so much and see you in my next video bye <laughs> the new me <laughs> yo you people did not tell me this is what i signed up for like oh jesus christ is this what i'm going to be doing oh my first test let's hit the road let me drive for the first time with my new glasses let's do this guys I'll get safely, but yeah, I have no complaints. I'm enjoying it. It's a smooth and sailing 